Hi, I'm Brandon from AC Infinity, and this is our CO2 regulator. Designed to increase carbon dioxide levels in your environment, it can release a controlled amount of carbon dioxide from a CO2 tank when it is powered and stop its flow anytime power is cut. Attaching a CO2 regulator to a CO2 tank is a relatively simple process. First, make sure the CO2 tank valve is closed. Next, locate the regulator inlet fitting, ensure that the plastic grommet is attached to the center of this fitting, then attach it to the tank valve. Use a wrench to screw the inlet fitting onto the valve in a clockwise direction, making sure it is tightened securely. This will ensure the plastic grommet creates an airtight seal between the CO2 regulator and the CO2 tank. Turn the tank valve on by slowly turning it counterclockwise. This will allow the gas to flow through the regulator. The pressure gauge will display the current tank pressure, which lets you know how much CO2 is left in the tank. Attach the dispensing tubing to the barbed fitting and place the end of the tubing at your desired release location. Plug in the CO2 regulator and adjust the pressure by turning the flow adjustment knob clockwise. The green ball on the flow meter will let you know the current flow rate. Once you reach the desired flow rate, you can unplug the CO2 regulator. You can pair this CO2 regulator with our CO2 controller for the most precise level of control. But you can also plug it into a cycling timer if you are working with the CO2 PPM timing chart.